The hill is easy enough to find. A short journey past the new market gate, and you see it jutting out on the edge of the corpse wood, looking like a rat under a rug. Hi, it's Rudy. Welcome back to Gloomhaven. Uh, only short rests, I can definitely do that. And uh, five or more monsters, or thirteen or more—I don't think I'll get that, but we'll never—you never know. Take care of these unfortunates, your target says, backing out of the room. You can vaguely make out his silhouette as he retreats down a hallway. Well. It's not every day we get people stupid enough to hand deliver their valuables to us, bandits, unsheathing a rusty blade. We'll be killing you now. Jokes on them. If you had any valuables, you probably wouldn't be down here in the first place. <laughs> I always like that. All right, <clears throat> we're going to give this another go. Let's see if we can do what it is we need to do. A little dagger action and a move for him. And I think uh, moving up and attacking for three was pretty good last time. Oh, there's another move. Well, let's just do um, Mana Bolt and Fire Orbs. All right, <clears throat> first up, move up. Bickety bamity boom. Come on. Minus two. Why am I getting negatives? Is it just grunts? They shouldn't have like bonuses, if you ask me. Well, thank you, Spell Weaver. That was. Well, it was something anyway. Well, actually, two would put me... No, I wouldn't be able to hit everybody. Oh, yeah, I might. Or would I just hit those ones? Oh, I think it's those ones. So let's let's throw a dagger at you. Man, poor... Poor showing there. What happens if I push him? Uh, skip movement. Push. No, I can't push you through a door. That's unfortunate, too. <clears throat> My, but that's a lot of damage. Alright, I will burn a card for that, even though that's probably a poor choice. Uh, let's drop, let's drop, grab, and go. I'll take one for sure. Yeah, I'll take one on each. That's fine. Okay, uh, now I can hit three in front of me. So how about like a, a leaping cleave and a trample maybe? And we want to get past these guys. Well, let's definitely use this to attack and mobilize on the guy in front of me. And maybe I'll summon a mystic ally if I can do both. Wow, they are moving fast today. Ouch. Poisoned. I don't understand how they can shield up. 
Alright, I'm gonna use my, my shield here. They're doing like fours to this guy. I don't understand. Okay, let's confirm that mystic ally. And we'll give this donk a whack. It's only gonna do one, I think. Uh, nope. It's not even gonna do one. I wonder if something that gives me more bonuses to things. So, let's do... Uh, let's try to take these two guys out. Nothing to this guy. That's just beautiful. That's that's what you want to hear. I realize now I did those out of order. Man, that was some bull crap. And I'm going to come back in the room. I feel like our start last time was better than this. Alright, obviously... Skewer is the, is the move. Let's go heal and skewer. And I need to do some good damage here. So how about... Yeah, like a flame strike and an impaling eruption. Hmm, okay. She's faster, but I don't think she'll be able to do much from back there. Skewer these SOBs. Okay, see, that's much better. I'm much happier with that. Heal yourself for two. Or you might actually live to fight another day. That's great. Oh, Mystic Ally, just doing all the good stuffs. Okay. The range is four. One, two, three. I can hit one of those guys. I will get some gold, which is good. Gold is always good. Yeah, let's hit the dude on the left, because that's the way we gotta go. Not bad. Okay, so this round, better than last round. I think I'm starting to get in the hang for this game, but it's... It's touchy. Alright, let's go shield bash and overwhelming assault, and we will short rest next time. Uh, you're going to have to short rest now. Uh, I wonder if you could long rest. Actually, let's long rest. It was you who could only short rest. Oh, that was the last time. Okay, so I want to move up to here. Uh, yeah. Move, push two, one, one, two. It's not huge. Okay, let's let's uh, move to there. Confirm him and push back to. <clears throat> and hopefully we'll just finish this guy off as cleanly as possible. Very nice. Now I think I will use that healing potion because the archer is too close. Glad I did now. That would have finished me, so. Not great.
let's burn Flamed Strike. Because we're going to need the healing, I feel like. Short rest for the Brute. We will lose his heal, or I could take damage. I'm going to I'm gonna burn that one. I don't know why the game is always so nasty like that. Let's go... Um, So let's go Spare Dagger and Overwhelming Assault for that push. Uh, and then for you... I want one of these heals. Three. One, two, three. So I'm just out of the way. Let's go um, like that. We might end up looting instead, actually. Okay, see, that's that's perfect. So let's loot one. Okay, not bad. And heal this dude. There you go, Broody. I missed an opportunity to call him Broody. Brutey. Oh, that would have been pretty clever. That's annoying. Why am I immobilized? Oh, I got arrow shot. Well, now I'm disappointed. That's annoying. And I was going to shove him through all those traps. Uh, that's annoying. That's what you're there for. That's what you're there for. Gotta say. Okay, I can't short rest because I only have one card on the discarded pile, so I'm going to have to reviving ether. Well, that might be just fine. So. Alright, let's recover all my burn cards. Let's heal this dude. And we will hopefully get a chance to heal ourselves later. I definitely want you to move. Yep. Very nice. Okay. Now attack her. Beautiful. And then there's a push as well. Yes. Yes. Confirm the... Oh, yeah. Uh, I can't push her back. That's too bad. Confirm the push. Beautiful. Okay. So there's an opening in. That was a great turn. That's, that's sort of like what you want. Okay. So I'm going to have to short rest, I believe. Gonna have to lose that good card too. Okay, I want big moves, big moves. Let's do like that. Um, I wonder if I can get a move out of one of these. One, two, or three. One, two. All right, well. Okay, let's uh, let's do that. And can I move and still? No, I can't. Hmm, I'm not sure if that was worth it or not. through the door you find yourself face to face with the reason these bandits chose this particular hole to nest in animate bones 
unholy abominations of necromantic power. Nothing more to do but lay them to rest, along with the remainder of this troublesome rabble. I notice there's no treasure chest this time. Must be because I've already gotten it. Uh, one, two, three. If I stay here, I'm a target. But I can't throw my dagger in between, it looks like. So, I'm at full health. I don't have any protection or anything, but dagger it is. Alright, can't ask for much more than that. That's okay. Well, is it okay though, actually? Uh, let's go Skewer and Overwhelming Assault. And for you, I need to move, like, as far as we can go. Um, I feel like I'm going to be slow no matter what. So let's go fire orbs and impaling. Oh, that's not good, is it? If we can do a bunch of those, that would be great. But I should have used like a, a oh, ouch. Okay, burned a card for that. So far, so good. Yes, okay, so they can't actually hurt me, which is beautiful. So let's... Let's do this. That's enough for one. And a move of six. Alright, Mr. Cali, get into range, please. So, move four. I can't stop for that gold. I feel like I need to get in close here. Should buy him some boots. I want to get him. That's fine, actually. That's that's fine. I picked the wrong spell, but that's great. Might have been a waste of money, but if these guys were to close range and drop me, I don't, there's not much I could have done. Okay, so apparently you can short rest. Oh, he's exhausted. But apparently you can short rest with only two cards. Probably should have taken the damage there. Okay, let's burn mana bolt. We just have to kill these two guys. I should try to move. They're going to move up on me for sure. Oh, really? Okay. Well, that's actually not too bad. Okay, yes. Very good. Very, very good. All right, let's move up because I'm not going to be able to do anything else. Okay, Mr. Galley's first. Beautiful, and I think actually will take might take the the hit for me. So 
So I can move up here and loot. I don't know if this is a good plan. I could move up and loot one. No, finish the mission. Yes, okay, move up. She shouldn't be that great at dodging. Let's get moving. And finish this off. Okay, there we go. So, that's the mission done. Instead of letting it go another whatever, you never know what's going to happen. Alright, only short rest. Didn't quite get the 13 experience, even though I killed quite a bit. He gets a perk point. You need three perk points to upgrade a perk. And they can give you things like more pluses instead of negatives and a bunch of other bonuses. Yay, quest complete! We got XP! And we unlocked Barrow Lair in the Corpse Wood. Linked quests, yada yada yada. Okay, um, we could continue on. Uh, let's see now. Uh, how do I look at your? Yeah, one perk point, none for you. All right. I don't know why we wouldn't push on. Although you know, I'm gonna go back to Gloomhaven just to swap the. The Brute's armor. I think he'll do better in hide. I think I've got him in leather right now, but... Plus we get to have a city encounter, which is always nice. Ah, uh, the Sleeping Lion. Surely there's no better place to get a drink and relax after clearing out some dank dungeon. On this particular occasion, though, you're approached by a heavily scarred Inox. She sits at your table and pushes forward a piece of paper. An interested party would like to hire you to steal a valuable figurine from a residence in the battlements, she says matter-of-factly. The details are on the paper. Meet me in the back alley in two days' time after the job is done. Yeah. Okay. Turns out confidence isn't enough when it comes to sneaking in and out of well-guarded estate without being seen. You didn't get the figurine, and one of the guards got a pretty good look at you. Well, there goes our reputation. Well, maybe we should have been goody two-shoes. To the merchant! Alright, I do want to buy hide armor. Buy it. I would like to have that on top of the shield, because they do very similar things. I could give you a heater shield. I wonder if that would actually help. Oh, right. Movement. Boots of striding it is. No money for the temple. On to the barrel layer. Encounter. You are walking down the road when the sound of many wings pulls your gaze to the sky. Above you, you see a large flock of white birds flying southward. At that height, you figure a well-aimed arrow could bring down one of them to make a nice meal. Sure. You pull back your bow and take aim. The arrow flies true and connects with one of the birds. You retrieve it, pluck it, cook it, and eat it. Definitely the beats definitely beats the field rations you were carrying, and we are blessed. That's awesome. Alright, I think I will leave the video here before we get into the barrel lair. When we come back. The barrel lair. Thank you for watching. Like, subscribe, and or comment.